Hi. Today we're going to tell you how request refund in Google Ads. If you have to request a refund in Google Ads, you need to take certain steps before submitting your request. This video will steer you in the right direction by illustrating all the steps which are required to request a refund in Google Ads. Let's get started. What are the steps to request a refund in Google Ads? Before submitting any request, you have to provide the correct data to Google for indicating any fake clicks. Do not make the mistake of sending your entire history as you can't expect Google to go through your entire ad clicks and find out the fraud clicks. Once you have collected enough evidence to prove some fake or suspicious clicks on your ads, follow these steps to claim a refund. Collect all important information from your side. Make sure you collect all necessary information from your end, account login ID, Google Ads customer ID, date when the suspicious activity began, date when suspicious activity ended, campaigns affected, ad groups affected, keywords affected, a summary of the issue, IP addresses, suspicious sites, and a copy of your web logs or tracking data. Fill out the Google Ads refund request form. Once you have collected all details, fill out Google's click quality form. Make sure you provide the correct information so that you have a good chance of getting a refund. You will get a response from Google within six weeks regarding your refund request. Note, remember, only 20 to 25% of claims receive successful refunds, and you can only make one refund request within 60 days. So, make sure you track your fake or suspicious clicks carefully and submit the report with adequate evidence for ensuring a successful refund. Hope you found the information useful. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out our videos with other great Google marketing solutions for your business. Thank you. Have a good day. Bye.